Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be just some clips that I've taken over the past week or so. Um, just some random things I've been up to whenever I decided to pick up the camera. That's going to be in this video. Um, I started editing it and I realized that I never made an intro like I thought I started the vlog and I didn't. Um, so I just kind of like started talking out of nowhere. Um, but I wanted to add this little clip in the beginning just to start it out. I have just been busy. We're getting ready to move. Later on in this video you'll hear me say that we're moving in eight days. But now it's been a few days since I recorded that and now we are moving in... What's today? Wednesday? Thursday? Friday? So we're moving on Saturday so it's like two-ish days away. Um, and I feel like I need to get some stuff done here. Like I haven't, we don't have to be out of the house completely until the 31st. So we still have time. Like we can move to my mom's and bring, you know, what we're going to need there um, and still have stuff here. And then we could move it to the storage unit. The only thing is we're getting a truck. So we want to move the big stuff while we have the truck and we're getting the truck on Saturday. So I'm going to try to move as much as we can. Um, but we can still have like little things here that we, I don't know, didn't grab. We could still, we'll still have some time to come back and make another run up here and move stuff out if we need to, which I'm, I'm sure we'll need to. Um, it's kind of crazy moving some stuff to storage and some stuff to my mom's and trying to decide what we should put in storage. I feel like I'm going to be doing some runs back to the storage unit. Like, I don't know, just like figuring, just like realizing later on that I actually need something or that the kids want something that's in storage. Um, but right now, I am about to take this play kitchen right here, bring that out to the curb. Um, garbage is in two days, so maybe someone will take it. It's kind of falling apart a little bit, so I don't think anyone's really going to want that. Um, but I'll put it out there anyway and then get rid of that and then maybe roll up this rug too and get rid of the rug. Friday now. Um, I've been busy around here. We are, what's today? So we are moving in eight days, um, but we don't close until the 31st. So we're moving to my mom's house on the 18th. And then we have movers coming on the 21st just to move a few of our big things. Um, um, our storage unit is kind of filling up a little bit. I haven't, I don't have like an updated clip to show you but next time I go there I'll make sure to show you what it looks like but it's starting to fill up a little bit and it's getting me a little bit worried I'm like are we gonna need another one because Greg still has all his stuff in the basement 
that he needs to put somewhere. Um, so I don't know. And the, like some of the stuff we're putting into our storage unit soon is like bigger things. Um, I took the boys' beds apart yesterday. There they are. So they will be going into storage. There also was a shelf. There used to be a shelf here, like a wooden shelf. I took that down. That is going into storage too. Um, which reminds me about the bed thing. I have to order them a bunk bed from Amazon. I have to get that ordered, have it sent to my mom's house, and I have to go there and put it together so that way when we move, it's already set up and we can just like put their beds on it. Um, but I feel like I have packed up pretty much everything that I can because a lot of the stuff that we're going to need at my mom's house, we also need here. Like, I'm not really bringing anything over there that we don't use or that I don't foresee us needing. Um, so it's all like everyday things that is going to go over there. So there's not really much left to pack up. I feel like I'm a little bit at a standstill right now just because there's not really much else I can do until we actually like move everything out of the house, you know. We were just at Walmart though, and I was able to pick Paisley up a couple little things. She really needs some summer clothes, so I got her this little shirt, and then this one. Good vibes only. Yes, you're never allowed to be upset. Only good vibes. And then this one, oh, I forgot to take that label off. Um, a little cupcake, and then I just got her a little pair of shorts. So, she got a couple things for spring and summer. Okay, so it is Saturday now. Um, I am out. I just picked up something for Noah that he has been asking for for like three years now. It's Power Wheels. So he doesn't know that I went to get it, so he's going to be very excited hopefully when I get back home and I show him what I got. But This is what I got for Noah. It's a four. Oh, here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. Whoa, what the heck? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> I told Noah that I was getting boxes for moving, but it was really a power wheels. Leave it down, waiting for Daddy. To, leave it, leave it, leave it. I'm waiting for Daddy to help me get it out. Hold it down. <laughs> there you go. Hold it down. But you have to steer. <laughs> <laughs> we need some practice, okay. I think. <laughs> Hi guys, so it is... What's today? What's today? Tuesday? Today's Tuesday. I am down in the basement right now. Chase and I are trying, are trying to take apart the little love seat down here. Let me show you. I don't know if you guys remember, but it's like a two-seater, like big bulky recliner. And when we moved in here, the moving guys like moved it down the stairs. No problem, probably. But Greg and I need to get this out of here because we're getting rid of it. We're not having movers do most of the stuff. We're just having them move a few things and this is not one of them. Um, so I'm trying to see if I can take it apart. It's not like one of those where, I, at least I don't think it is. I don't think the back just comes off. I've never known the back to come off of this, but what Chase and I just did was we used a drill to get uh, this bar off. Where was this? This was like, this was like on top of it like that. And there was one up here too. We already got that one off. So this is the second one. And it's just so disgusting in there. Look at that. I found a nursing pad stuck in here from probably, probably from you, Chase. I think this is where I used to sit to breastfeed you. <laughs> oh, look. It comes apart in two pieces. Yeah. Look, now we have two separate. Oh, I'm so smart. I'm so proud of myself. I saw that one piece I was connecting them and now they're connected. All right, now we just have to see if the back comes off. Unfortunately, 
I don't think it comes apart anymore like easily. I think we'd have to like take all the take everything apart underneath the thing and it's just like probably not strong enough to carry this up the stairs like I probably shouldn't try to do that by myself. So I don't want to fall down the stairs and like kill myself so. Okay I got the kids eating dinner making one more grilled cheese and while that's cooking I'm gonna make a box for kitchen stuff. This box packed up about halfway, maybe a little more, and I'm gonna stop here, even though I could fit more in the box because it's pretty heavy. Well, it's heavy enough for me, so I don't wanna make them too heavy where I can't even lift them. Um, or like, you know, the boxes break. So this is my second kitchen box that I have going. It's pretty heavy as it is. Again, there's some pans in there and can opener, a bunch of knives. Look how I did the knives. I was pretty proud of myself. I wrapped them up all in a big towel and then put like elastic bands on the end of it. I thought that was so smart. <laughs> um, but it's kind of full, I mean it's kind of heavy so I don't know. I might just add like a, the uh, I might just add the muffin pan and like, I don't know, there's something else down here I think. Oh no, another little baking sheet, I already put that in there. But I'm, I'm gonna need the muffin pan I think for tomorrow. Make the kids muffins, because Chase wanted muffins. Um, so I'm gonna use that one more time and then Put it in here and then I think that box will be done. Um, so yeah, making some progress. But I think this is going to be it for this video. Um, Noah still loves the Power Wheels. He has played on it every day since I got it. Since, since we got it. Um, so the excitement hasn't worn, out, worn off yet, but we'll see how long it takes for it to wear off. Um, that's why I got it used though and not like went out and bought a $300 power wheel because I figure he'll be excited about it for like a couple weeks probably and, and then I feel like it's gonna die off so but we'll see um but anyway that's pretty much it for this video hope you guys enjoyed watching thank you for watching and I'll see you next time <laughs>